In this segment, we're going to talk a little bit about our plates, our rollers, and our doctor blades, and, and the care of these items and how they're used. First, the plates. So we have two sizes, the uh, 6 by 15 and the 10 by 24. We also have, uh, they're, they're either available in the purple or this, uh, or the, the green color. Which, whichever one you get in your kit, uh, they're the same and they, they are cared for the same way. <laughs> Viva paper towels. So they work really well for all aspects of the wood graining. Now you'll notice sometimes on the corner you might see where it looks like there's a little film, but you don't want to peel anything off of these plates. They're ready to use. Uh, there's nothing that needs to be peeled off of them. If you peel anything off, you're going to ruin the plate. So don't try to do that. Some, some have um, done that in the past and uh, we've had to replace the plates. So they're ready to go. When you're wood graining with them, you want to use our U-Pole uh, Wax and Grease Remover to clean the plate after you're done. So that's basically it for the plates. They don't really require any special care and they're ready to go. Just the first time that you use them you want to... When you, the roller, when you get your roller it'll be packed in a box and it's going to have some powder on it and that's just cornstarch to help keep uh, the, the roller dry in the box. When they're new, they leach just a little bit of oil. So what you want to do when you get your roller the first time before you use it is clean it real well in your sink. Um, just rinse it off with water and then use uh, Dawn dishwashing detergent and just uh, put that that uh, soap on there and use your thumbs and just scrub the whole surface of this roller and uh, that'll clean it and then let it air dry or you can dry it with a towel, a lint free towel and then it's ready to use. So as you're using the roller it will get stained a little bit on the face and that's a good thing. In fact, uh, if you look at some of my rollers, you'll see that they're really black from use. And the more stained they get, really the better they work. So remember to clean it, all you need to do is roll it across the paper. And that's all. Now with your handle, if you just uh, lubricate this with a little water, just spray a little water on there and then it just uh, goes right into the roller. Oh, one, one other thing, if, if your roller doesn't spin freely like this one does, sometimes it may uh, bind up a little bit, all you need to do is just hit it on the table and that will loosen it up and then it's ready to go. So then the roller just slides right on there. This isn't lubricated but it really helps if you do lubricate it. And there you go. Now your roller's on the handle. Again to clean it you roll it across the paper. That's all there is to it after the initial cleaning with the Dawn detergent. Okay? With the doctor blades we have two sizes, uh, the, the uh, 5 inch and the uh, 8 inch. So you're going to use the 5 inch with the smaller plates there and the 8 inch with the large plate. One thing you'll notice with these doctor blades, if you look at the blade, there's a beveled edge there. Look real close at it and you can see that on one side there's a bevel. Now the beveled edge is the side that goes forward. For instance, if the beveled edge is on this side, right here, this side, I'm going to use the blade like this. See, beveled edge always goes forward. If I'm going to pull the ink back toward me, like this. Okay? And uh, you can experiment with your angles. You know, you can uh, anywhere from a 90 degree angle to a little, um, little less of an angle. You know, and just experiment with it and then get it to where you really uh, like it. But it doesn't, uh, it's not critical anywhere from a 90 to, uh, oh, I don't know, about a 45. Okay. 
So that explains the plates, the rollers, and the doctor blades.